a micro video. Um, today we're going to talk about a new feature in Django CMS 3.0 uh, which is a really small thing, but whoever committed it, and I really should look it up in the code base to see who it was because it was just a, a stroke of genius, uh, is simply a small context variable, CMS template. Um, it uh, allows us to more tightly integrate our uh, app hooks and their templates into the CMS. And let me explain um, by example. So, well, actually, let me contrast to what, it, to, to what we had in previous versions. In previous versions of the CMS uh, 2.4 and, and uh, earlier, when you wrote an app hook, you kind of just resigned to the fact that the templates of your app hook will, will, will totally supersede any templates that you have in uh, your CMS. So the, when the user, your end users, the operators of your CMS are adjusting some of the settings of the page, one of those settings is the template that they want to use on the page and that was largely ignored on app hooks in earlier versions. Well with this, with this very simple change in the code base we now have a context variable CMS template which basically stores the path to the currently set template on that page and if you include that as part of your extends tag in your app hooks template then that means you can now extend whatever template the user has decided that page was going to use uh, so again by um, I'm going to show by example so here's my leadership page from the previous video and um, oops I haven't logged in I better log in real quick so um, Oops. So now that I'm on this page, I can, um, you know, even though this is an app hook, I can change the template to say sidebar right, sidebar right in this case, and lo and behold, the plugin will in the sidebar will be on the right side because that's where the sidebar is. And similarly, I could change it to the full width, and now I no longer have a sidebar. Um, so, I know this, you know, for anybody who's just getting involved with Django CMS uh, from 3.0 onwards, uh, they probably were, were thinking, well, this is just the way it works, right? But if you're a veteran user who used to use anything before 3.0, you are probably, like me, frustrated with the fact that there was no simple way to integrate app hook templates with the CMS. And now there is, and it, and like I said, it's as simple as just including extends and then CMS template um, at the top of your templates. Now you have to be clever about the way you create your templates to begin with. Um, it's just it's not going to perform magic, um, but uh, you know if you have templates that define regions, like in this case I have an app content region. I also have defined. Um, not in this particular template, but uh, in the base template, I've, I've, I've defined a block app sidebar, and that's where the sidebar uh, uh, plugins uh, would appear. Um, anyway, so if you haven't explored that yet uh, and you're a veteran user, you will probably be as happy as I was to discover that feature. And there you go. That was my brief video on CMS templates. Cheers.